Welcome back guys to a new video here on the channel. In this video I'm going to be showing you guys how to use the FLS engine or the FLS modifier. Um, the download links are in the description. So basically what you're going to want to do is download NBA2K hook, put those files in your uh, to NBA2K directory and or in your 2K game folder and also your FLS engine and the bin free folder. Um, then you want to run FLS engine 2K22.exe file as an administrator. You want to click this clock thing and you want to click this orange button. This text, you, you also need to have the game launched. And also, if you have a later version than me, um, you you don't don't you i think you launch the game with this button so if 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 something red comes up you want to close the game and you want to uh, launch the game through fls engine or you want to click this button with the game closed um but yeah then when you go in game you're gonna see this comes up so if you have a later version than 2.0 um, I got the game cracked about right after when it came out, um, so mine won't like auto update because it's cracked. Um, but if you guys have a later version, you guys want to press this arrow and you can choose uh, to have it on English. Although this menu won't be in English, but I have made a like translation pictures that you guys can get. So um, this just turn on. Nice to turn. I don't know what this is, but um, this um, this thing makes your every your all of your my career stats 99. Uh, you get every badge on Hall of Fame, unlimited stamina, unlimited takeover, unlimited A plus teammate grade. All right. Um, and then here is like to refresh the list and then you're gonna choose a player you want to edit the stats on So let's just take Seth Curry for an example And then we can change some stuff and then here this menu when in the middle is the trade menu So you just press this to kind of engage it. Let's say I want to trade Drew Holiday to the um, The Bulls for Zach Levine or something and then I press this button and then it will be done um, So I, I have these pictures I can leave uh, I can put them in a WinRAR folder and I can like give you guys the download link for it um, and here's for the middle section you know of the first one um, but yeah you guys can go ahead and check that out um, so there is a bunch of stuff you can do I am going to launch my cheat engine for so I can play um 2k or i can play my career offline um i have a video tutorial on that link in the description um so then i can show you i'm gonna go into no 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 that's the wrong one um this is one i made a tutorial on or the one that was in the tutorial um so this one I have, and then you, so basically this is like the part two of that video, why is he named Bobo? Oh yeah, so his name got changed when I made that video, hold on, um, no I'm not going to do that now, um, so basically let's check the rosters, so let's take, um, who should we trade, oh my god, they got a bad roster, um, Clint Capello or something, I don't know, um, Who could we trade? I want to trade. Okay, let's trade James Harden for Bradley Beal. All right. So then you want to open this menu. You want to click the middle section. You want to choose the team. So obviously, James Harden is on the Cavaliers here. Or he may not be there because. So if you open it before you go into like my career, you're going to have to refresh it. So this button is to refresh. All right. Um, so the Cavaliers, and now you can, s it's just, yeah, here, James Harden. And then we got, where did he play? Did he play for the Wizards? I don't know. 
Actually, though, where did he play? Did he play for the... Oh, he played for the Bulls. Alright, um... So, we're gonna change this second one to the Bulls. It doesn't matter which one you have on top and on bottom. And then we're gonna choose Bradley Beal, and then we click this button, and then it gets, like, engaged, we can say, or something. Um, and then I just go in and out, and then you'll see on the Bulls, we have James Harden, and on the Cleveland Cavaliers, we have Bradley Beal. And you can also do this with yourself. So, currently, I am on the Portland Trailblazers, because I want to win a ring to Damian Lillard. Uh, Lillard. Um, and so... Jalen Brown is here. Wow, all right. Um, so I can trade myself too. So if I go to open it up, refresh the list, and then I will go to uh, Trailblazers. I will choose Bold Bold. So ND, when it's ND after, that means it is your character. Or your character always have ND afterwards. And then I'm going to get traded to like the Spurs. I don't know. What team, you know? Maybe the, the Lakers. They will get Russell Westbrook. And then I just press this button. And then you'll see this gets updated. And there we go. Um, but I'm going to trade myself back. Because I want to be in the, in the Trade Blazers. So there you see. I got traded back. Um, so it doesn't actually show up. And yeah, I'm the biggest snake. Portland. Milwaukee Lakers and Warriors. Um, so that's that. So now I'm going to show you guys how you... I showed you guys this with the My Career Modifying th stuff. And now I'm going to show you how to modify your stats. This, is, this could take quite a while. I have tried. I think at least I have those... Uh, one of those pictures in game... No, no, no. In game first time. Yeah, I have a, a few of the translations. So you can check that out. Um, although, I don't know, like baseball, fall committed, and stuff like that. So here, your overall won't change, alright? And you can also move this window. Um, so, what you can do is refresh the list, and then I'm going to go to the Trailblazers. I'm going to choose my character, and you see everything is on 110. That's because I used a modifier. So you see... You can just play around and drag a bunch of these values around. Alright, so I just dragged this and I saw it was mid-range shot. Okay? Um, and then... I accidentally moved it with my controller. So, and this one, oh, it's three-point shot. And you see... Um, so, you can go ahead and you can play around with those. It could take a while, but it is... It is nice to do, um, I think. I believe that. Yeah. And also, I'm like the goat of the goats. Because I played everything on. I, I don't... I'm gonna show you guys this. Um, uh, I have averaged a triple-double my entire career. <clears throat> no, season. Yeah, almost my entire career. Here you see all my stats. And this also. But yeah, so that's that. I don't think there's anything else. I showed you guys this. I showed you guys uh, how you change the overall of players. And then with the trade menu. Um, so yeah, you are done. You now know how to use the engine. The link to the, um, to the translations will be in the description. Or my translation pictures that I made. Just so you guys can know how to use it much better. Alright? Yeah, thank you guys for watching. I'll see you in the next video. Goodbye.